All right, one after another. Now you're going one after another down here. Five. How many we got down here? Six. All right. Now it's going to be one after another, but you're competing at both ends, making consecutive shots, not just a number. All right. Again, for the purpose of the drill, we want to make two in a row before the entire group runs to the next wing. Okay. You ready? Step in. You ready? Step in. Here we go. Go. You're competing against the other group. One, go, quicker. It's quicker, you're getting shots off. Move. Let's go. Step in. One. Let's go, let's go. Good job down here. Shoot your shot. Be down and ready, ready to shoot your shot. One. Got to get off that. Let's go. See the ball go in, down and ready, down and ready. Good job, move. Let's go, you guys are stuck in that spot. Can't be stuck in that spot. Somebody step up, one, let's go. They're on the last spot down here. One. Oh, stop, stop ball. They made it around the world, okay? Now for coaches, for coaches, the same, the same drill you can do off a of shot fake, one dribble pull-ups on your own. You can do it as a team, all right? So you got off the catch, you got one dribble right pull-up, one dribble left pull-up, all right? Let's move on to the next drill. Do we have any questions on that drill? You set the number for what you want it to be for your specific team or a specific individual. If you have a knockdown shooter, that number's gonna be five in a row, six in a row, seven in a row, that he can realistically make that number, okay? Let's move on to the next drill.